Hello everyone. In this video, you are uh, uh, trying to learn how to find out the quadratic equation. I mean, roots of a quadratic equation. So you here you'll you'll provide a quadratic equation and then uh, how the roots are being um, calculated for that. We'll check out in this program. Uh, so as usual, uh, you should know the basic thing how we are going to calculate the. Uh, roots for a quadratic equation that is the basic formulas you need to know so for that first uh, the formula is if suppose the d value so what is that d d is nothing but your determinant value in your quadratic equation so right so if d is equals to b square minus 4 ac right so this was a formula for calculating your determinant of the quadratic equation if suppose that d is equals to 0 then you will tell that the roots are imaginary sorry real and equal so if your determinant value is equals to zero then you have the formula like root one is equals to minus b by 2a root two is also minus b by 2a if in case d value is greater than zero then you will tell that roots are real and for that you are having the formula like minus b plus or minus square root of uh, b square minus 4ac by 2a. This was the formula what we are trying to use when you are calculating the roots of quadratic equation. If suppose d value is something like it is which is less than 0, not the, uh, not is equals to 0, not greater than 0, then you will tell that simply roots are imaginary values, right? So these are the three conditions which we had seen in the mathematical format, right? So simply you need to implement all those by using simple uh, a square root uh, function which is already available in our math.h header file right so we'll go through one by one in this one so first you are trying to include stdio.h and then math.h as i said we need to find out the square root right square root of b square minus 4 yes we need to find out so for that reason the square root is predefined function which is already available in your math.h header file so that is the reason you are including their math.h if you don't you uh, if you are not going to use that header file you'll get an error right uh, right so void main then i declare the four variables a b c and d d is for determinant a b c are the coefficient like you are you'll have x square uh, plus x plus c uh, i mean a x square plus b x plus c you will have no so for that uh, coefficients you need to read so those coefficients are read into a b and c and then in the next step first i am trying to find out what is the determinant value whether it is equals to zero or greater than zero or less than zero right so d is equals to b into b that is b square minus 4 a c so when you will try to calculate that one if suppose your d value is equals to zero then you will print that the roots are real and equal and for that root 1 is equals to root 2 is equals to minus b by 2a. This was the basic formula which you need to remember when you are trying to calculate the quadratic roots of a quadratic equation right and then you are trying to print out root 1 is some uh, whatever the value you are uh, root 1 and whatever the root 2 value is there those two you will print right else if if suppose my d value is not equals to 0 I need to check out the other condition whether d is greater than 0 if suppose d value is greater than 0 then I can tell that printf roots are real and for this, the formula is equals to root 1 is equals to minus b plus square root of d by 2a. So generally, we used to tell uh, like minus b plus or minus square root of d square minus 4ac by 2a, right? So that was the actual formula. Why I'm using here d is d is nothing but your b square minus 4ac, which we had calculated in the beginning, right? So square root of d by 2a, simple. So, if you are trying to implement this part, I mean, if your d value is greater than 0, then you will use these two formulas and then you will print root 1 and root 2 or else. So, if else, if else. So, even if this condition is also false, you will tell that roots are just imaginary, right? So, we'll just try to execute this one. We'll see what output we'll get. Okay. So first you compile the code, sorry, first you compile it and then you run that program. So it is asking you three coefficients. So I would like to give um, 
वन फाइव सिक्स राइट सो इट इज लाइक एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस फाइव एक्स प्लस सिक्स right so if you'll just calculate that you will get the roots as root 1 is minus 2 and root 2 is equals to minus 3 other than this if i give some other values we'll check whether we'll get on the one also right so same uh, 1 uh, 4 and 3 right so the roots are again real it, uh, the roots are minus 1 and 3 right so like this if you are trying to do that uh, you will get different different values so if i just give another value we'll check out once again 1 2 1 right so the roots are real and equal you will get the values as 1 minus 1 and Minus one, right? So this is what is happening with your uh, uh, finding out the roots of the quadratic equation, right? Yes. <clears throat> so that's all for this video regarding finding out the roots of a quadratic equation. Thank you all.